Hi guys, welcome again to Review Hub. So today I'm gonna react to the first episode of Squid Game. No, what am I gonna do next? Oh god, I even have homework to do. Forget all that forsaken homework, every human. You won't have much time left anyway. What? Who the hell are you? See, you're already cursing in front of death, you donkey without a tail. No wonder God specifically asked for your death. Did Maharaja Bully send you? You're calling me a very fit, strong, healthy teenage boy? A gay man? Leave me alone and go have a mental checkup. You blinded fool! Can't your stupid eyes send the message your brafrim bane brain that I'm death who is sent by God? I don't care. Opinion, sexuality, religion, age, anything doesn't matter when you're on the verge of non-existence. Dude, I'm gonna call 119. You better vanish. What? What did you do to my baby? Wait, are you the actual Doctor Strange or Scarlet Witch or Dumbledore? <clears throat> I am the one and only mighty death. I was summoned by God who is real to reap your soul. And these are the last 24 hours of your life. It is highly unusual that... What? No! I'm still a 17 year old sweet little boy. I mean, I may have mm, bullied some kids, lied and cheated on an exam, but I don't think I should die for it. I haven't even cheated on my diet plan. Now it's too late to make apologies. Besides, you don't get to decide. God does. And she has decided that you will die tomorrow. That's it. End of discussion. Tomorrow? No, it it's too soon. <laughs> I don't want to die alone. Can I have a companion, please? Sure, whatever. But make sure that you and your companion are ready by sundown tomorrow. Not that he'd find anybody because friendships are like dawn, you know, doom, you know, type. Thank you. Thank you. I'll go now. I bet my friend won't let me down. Oh, okay. I'll just get to zoom it with my best bud. He's always up for some regard of Malasamiya. I'm sure he'd love to die with me. I mean, he swore that he'd be with me for eternity when we were in kindergarten, so... Ayo, bro, why did you wake me up this early for say? <laughs> Good morning. Don't you have anything else to do? Oh, for God's sake, this is about your YouTube channel, though. Did you have a nightmare? It's uh, not how you think you. God's kind of decided I should die tomorrow and I need you to come with me. What? Bro, are you out of your mind? Are you nuts? I sleep talking. You are doing fine, right? What nonsense are you talking about? Look, man, I don't believe you one bit. But even if I did, I would do everything just for you. You gotta be considering. You are asking too much. You swore that you'd be with me forever. Maybe it was my fault for thinking that such childish promises would stay true. I'm moving on. It's been too long. And now I know to find my end. I'm leaving you. Dude, fine. 
if you want to continuously mock our friend, mock me. From now on, I'm not your buddy. Talk to Goods if you want and see how well she'll take your jokes. Bye, everyone. <laughs> Goodbye, tonight, all for you, my friend. <laughs> I can't believe that he just ditched me. I should have known that this friendship was a hoax. <sighs> Time to meet a fabulous influencer. You can't pay me by tomorrow? Oh, honey, just sell your kidney at something. People do that all the time these days. Ah, hello, my dear fabulous teen caller. I gotta go. How are the fabulous days? <laughs> they ain't fabulous because I'm about to die tomorrow. Oh no, this poor, poor fella. Oh yes. It's so unfortunate to hear such unpleasant news. But it was to be expected, dear. What do you mean you mean? So this means that you're gonna come with me, right? Hell no, boy. Why the hell do you want me? To die with you. Why did you keep using the word hell? Duh, I'm emphasizing on the fact that I'm not gonna join you. When she's gone, when she's gone, you're gonna miss her when she's gone. You're gonna miss her by your heart, you're gonna miss her everywhere. Oh, you're gonna miss her when she's gone. Oh, I don't really need a musical entrance. It's really too much. Hey, good deeds. Oh, wait, here, you have a new friend. I'm not so sure you know who he is because he barely pays attention to you. I have no idea who this young lad is. He's about to die tomorrow and he wants you to come with him. I mean, he is a very charming, handsome fellow to die with. Then why on earth aren't you coming with me? Well, I have my boundaries. I'm not going to leave everything just for you, even if you were the last handsome boy on earth. Um, I know a person who can help you. Um, with knowledge. Hey, fella, you might not know me. But I know you really well. Well enough to know that you are really thrilled. Knowledge? That's not nice of you at all. Every human needs encouragement, not negativity. Good deed is right, knowledge. Your actions are less than acceptable in this situation. You should learn how to speak considering the environment you're in. Like I do. It's not that hard. Well, it isn't for me, of course. But I suppose even a mediocre person like you could. Whoa, cut a Lawyer roll and get your head in the game. I thank God every day. I woke up. Feeling this way, and I can't help loving myself, and I don't need nobody else. Nuh -uh. If I was you, I wanna be me too. Wanna be me too. Wanna be me too. Holy moly, who is this gorgeous guy? What? What did you just say in my life? Oh, no, no, no. Nothing. <laughs> Sorry for distracting you guys with my looks. Man, I shouldn't have worked out that much. But can we please all focus on the fact that I'm going to die after a few hours? Not after a few hours, every human. Your time is up. Please, 
I can't die now. Please give me some more time. I have to make my mind to leave this earth. I have done so many wrong things and yeah, I, I agree, but I, I can't give up my life so easily. I will give whatever you want. My parents have enough money, so just ask whatever you want. You can't drive death, no matter how hard you try, boy. You have no other choice and keep in mind, all the things cannot be bought by money. It's God's will. If you didn't forget good deeds, commit sins and had enough money, enough knowledge to understand the reality of the world and your life, this wouldn't have been this hard for you. Boy, I feel like you don't need me anymore. No, wait, please. She left. Uh, we don't need to stay here. Yeah, let's leave, dear. Let's all live together. Can I give you a ride? <laughs> Where did they go? Did they come back? Did they leave me alone here? Am I left alone? I've seen dark before, but not like this. This is cold. This is empty, this is numb, the life I knew is over, the lights are out, hello darkness, I'm ready to succumb. My boy, stop crying, you can face this. Good deeds, you are here with me? Why did the others sleep? Good deeds, hello? down on earth. You aren't doing so well, buddy. When good deeds, when goods left on her own on earth, you lost all material things you held dear to you. When beauty and strength left, you became weak and your face sunk and empty and white empty. When five senses came tumbling after them, you couldn't hear, taste, feel, smell and see. When knowledge chased after them all, you lost your wit. Every human, you know what's happening to you, right? Surely you heard your parents' prayers as you battled a losing fight? Death was right. Come, every human, now that you have realized the truth of life, you are free to roam this new world, away from that sin. Thank you, good Jades. Now I realize that the only thing matters at the end is you. I'm ready for my afterlife. Oh.